Hello, I'm back. Where did he go? What happened? It's finally back. I wonder if you miss me. Ah, oh, shh. So today, after popular request, I'm going to do a review on the X5 wireless guitar system. That's right. I do reviews now. The guys at X5 introduced themselves to me at the uh, NAMM. Just like a NAM. Uh, the NAM show, which is where a lot of companies get together and kind of um, show off their new toys. Now the guys at X5 hit me up and said, hey, we want you to trial uh, these little wireless systems. I've been using wireless for quite a while. It's just nice to go wireless sometimes. So they hit me up with a little X5, which uh, we're gonna do a little zoom in now. Up in the sky, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's Superman. Yep. Now, basically what they are, they're like a lot of these other kind of bug uh, wireless systems. They're just two little things, a receiver, a transmitter. You plug the transmitter in your guitar, the receiver in your pedal board, you slap some around the face, and then you're good to go. So what I'm gonna do today is just like a really simple kind of review on these things. They're pretty basic, they're pretty straightforward. Essentially, you're just eliminating the cable, but I'm also gonna give you guys like a direct in sound check from the cable versus the transmitters to see that there's not really that much loss of quality. Um, I've used quite a lot of wireless systems over the years, like the um, people I'm not gonna name, and one of the biggest issues I have with them is um, you kind of lose tone or there's like a little bit of latency and there's a delay. So far, I um, had no issues with these. So le let's just jump into the demonstration. Okay, so for the purpose of the demonstration, I've got my trusty maiden and I'm gonna be going between A, B of the X5, which is plugged in the bottom here, direct into a sound desk with very minimal processing, just a bit of reverb. And then I'm just gonna go back and forwards um, between this and a direct cable, which is somewhere on the floor. You never find these cables when you don't want to find them, I'll tell you that much. A little bit of kind of percussion sounds. So as you can hear, there's actually very little difference between the cable going directly in and one of these little transmitters here. And this is a product that I was actually very keen on because it's such a simple thing, but they do it so well. Instead of trying to make all these like bells and whistles, like built-in tuners and, and volume pedals, it's just literally a bug, another bug, you plug one in, you plug one in and you're good to go. It's, it's just how all wirelesses should be. Now the wirelesses are charged up by a micro USB cable and they give you a little um, two-way splitter cable so you can charge them both at the same time. I find they take about one hour to charge and they usually give me about five or six hours of playing. If I'm doing like a big ass street festival or something where I'm trying to do like 15 shows in a day, I might have to recharge them twice or just bring a spare pair with you. But for the average player, you're not gonna play more than six hours. Who do you think you are? Do you think of me? So anyway, that's a quick review. They're called the X5U2, and I'll put a link in the description below if you'd like to check them out yourself. So that's the X5U2 wireless guitar system, available in all your local... internet websites. Check it out. <laughs>